Wu Zetian ordered the building of new Buddhist temples in every town in her empire, creating allies among the common people of China. And she didn't stop there. 250 miles east from her capital city of Chang'an in Henan province are the Lungmen Grotto Caves. Historian Liu Yong thinks they may be key to understanding Wu's power. This is a sacred place for uh, Buddhist religion and pilgrims have been coming here for centuries. Uh, but I have been told there is a connection that links uh, Empress Wu directly to that faith. So I'm coming here to figure that out. Members of the elite in Chinese society paid vast sums of money to be allowed to carve small caves into this sacred hillside. There are over 1,400, housing over 100,000 Buddha figures. The smallest is just an inch. But the tallest is a staggering 57 feet high, commissioned by Wu Zetian herself. And it has a story to tell. Wow, isn't this impressive? What a view. It is gigantic. The official name of this Buddha uh, is Vairojana, which is the radiant uh, Buddha uh, of a great sun. Uh, this is uh, uh, basically a universal Buddha, uh, symbolize the, uh, the power uh, and, and dominance uh, of this religion. Wu Zetian wanted to embed herself into Buddhism the religion of her empire. To do this, it's possible she took one audacious step. The legend says that this statue actually is modeled on her face. She wants to uh, make this uh, a statement uh, of her power. This will give her uh, more credibility because this is the age of Buddhism and there's a massive follower of, of this particular religion. And by uh, creating this temple, she basically uh, put herself on the center stage uh, of, of not just religious action, but also the society in general. You know, the seeing this with your own eyes is an incredible experience. This is so impressive to me, and I think she got what she wanted. 